I want to do this. Her mother says Ella French knew from an early age she wanted to make a difference in the world. And that desire is what led her into law enforcement and eventually the Chicago Police Department. In July, she was credited with helping save the life of a newborn child who was injured in a mass shooting in Inglewood, rushing the infant to a hospital in her squad car. A little more than a month later, French would lose her own life after being shot during a traffic stop. This is definitely not the ending I would have preferred, but Ella died doing what she wanted to do. She died living her passion. It's been a long nightmare for Ella's mother, Elizabeth. She raised Ella and her older brother as a single mother, adopting them as infants. She spoke during the funeral, remembering Ella, nurturing her love for animals, supporting her many activities, and being the proud but nervous parent of a Chicago police officer. Ella was a force of nature. Everything she did, she put her heart into it. Elizabeth French teaches special education in Berwyn. The family grew up in mostly DuPage County, where Ella attended Downers Grove North High School. County board members last week honored her with a proclamation. She was a, a big advocate of children, of animals, and uh, of life. And uh, to see that life come up short uh, to me was tough. Her mother says Ella had just bought her first home and was building a life with an eye toward the future. Her fellow officer, Carlos Yanez, was critically injured in the shooting and moved to rehab last week. When he's able, Elizabeth French hopes to meet with him. She says everyone in the police department has treated her like close family. I'm doing fine, but something is off in my world. There's just a piece of it missing that I need to learn to live with. The two suspects in the shooting remain held without bond. Elizabeth French says she's not too concerned with them right now. She's more concerned with honoring the memory of her daughter.